bells are rung every Sunday morning for 15 minutes before the service to call everybody into the, the kirk. It's a bit of a warren of corridors and stairs and it gets narrower and steeper the higher up the tower you get. And just at the moment when you think, well, I'm going to get jammed here or not be able to get my feet on the next step, you come through the door into the bell tower. Well, I was still at school when I started ringing the bells, so, so back in the very end of the 70s. And uh, my father was a uh, session clerk at the time. And at that time, the bells hadn't been rung for many years. So they gathered together quite a large group of people to act as bell ringers. And um, I went along and I didn't start immediately. I was a bit too small at that stage to actually reach the, the ropes and mark the pedals. But um, eventually in time, I, uh, I started ringing. And, uh, I left Orkney for some years and, uh, and obviously couldn't ring them while I was away but I restarted when I came back and I've been ringing them ever, ever since. The traditional way of ringing in, in, in English churches particularly is that the bell swings and the clapper stays still and that's what makes the noise and then you see the, the rope flying up and down which uh, is always used to comedy effect to hoist people in the air but this is quite different. The, the bell is fixed and hangs there and the clapper is pulled against a, a rope tied to the wall and um, it means that uh, one person can ring the three bells at once. Uh, one with your foot and one with each hand. It's something amazingly special. Every Sunday morning you think these bells have been here for over 500 years, um, coming up for 600, and uh, you're in a long line of people who've rung people into the church on a Sunday morning, but I've also rung them for special occasions, Christmas Eve services, um, for the tree lighting for many years I, I used to ring them for that, and I also rang them for the 900th anniversary of uh, the death of St Magnus, the, and St Magnus Day was a Sunday morning and I was happened to be the bell ringer on that day, which was an amazing thing to do.